Good afternoon, everyone. Um, my name is Dr. Rohit Bhojraj. I am uh, leading the whole effort of Apollo Children's across Apollo Hospitals in India. Um, I would like to welcome all the media persons who are here. I would like to welcome all the doctors. And the most guests. important for us is touching lives, right? So as we touch lives, we also touch little lives, which is children. So pediatrics is not new to us. We have been doing that for the last 40 years. But obviously, our mission in Apollo Children's now is to make sure that we increase our focus on pediatrics. What we're going to do is launch a new initiative to get all our pediatric services together and make sure that all our consultants are able to handle children in the way they like it the best. In this whole endeavor, um, it is very important that uh, you know the doctors are core to all the services we provide. But uh, it gives me great pleasure to have our chief guest here, uh, Ms. Upasana Kaminani Konidella. Thank you so much, Madam, for finding time. Uh, Upasana, Madam, is a third generation entrepreneur and philanthropist from the Apollo Hospitals family in India. So it's three generations now. She believes in creating sustainable businesses rooted in social welfare that create a deep long-term impact. And we, we've been seeing it, Madam. Her heritage of healing and building community infrastructure is reflected in her business ventures and her giving practices. You Are Life, which we all know, is built on the idea of urban wellness and productivity, while the Apollo Foundation is based on founder chairperson, um, our, our, our beloved chair, chairperson, Dr. Pratap Siraddigaru, model of uh, womb to tomb care. So that's, that's uh, Ms. Upasana. I would like to uh, invite Madam on the stage and please help us launch and introduce Apollo Children's to everyone. Thank you so much, sir. I would like to invite Dr. Koteshwar Rao, who's our senior pediatrician and uh, neonatologist. Sir, please come and if you can give welcome bouquet to madam. Can you bring it here? Madam, always, you know, um, you are a new mother and children love imagery. Imagery should be able to communicate the happiness and the care that we provide. And Apollo Children's, we have a mascot of our own. We would uh, request you to actually unveil the mascot and make sure that this is what we want our children to believe and embody. separate uh, wing all together called as Apollo Children. So all pediatric care across our ho Apollo hospitals will be consolidated under the brand image of Apollo Children's. So I would like to uh, request Madam to share a few words on her journey as well as her thoughts in this occasion. Good afternoon everyone. Thank you. I would like to start by saying a big, big thank you to all of you who have supported me in the journey of my pregnancy. Thank you for your blessings. Thank you for your love, especially the media. Thank you for being so supportive and making our pregnancy journey so beautiful. I'm really happy to be here at the Apollo Children's Hospitals uh, launch and the Apollo Pediatrics launch here. It's such a emotional journey for me and you know when a child gets sick it's something very sad for the parent but when the child goes back healthy and happy that's pleasure for all of us and thank you doctors thank you so much for bringing a smile on the children's face and on the parents face also as a mother i can feel this right now previously i used to see it on others but now i know what happens to uh, a lot of parents when the child actually gets sick. Thank you for working so hard. It really means a lot. During my pregnancy journey, I had so many people coming and supporting me, giving me advice. But with all these great blessings, I happened to come across something that was a bit painful also for a few people. So some women came up to me and then they said, you know, they really needed uh, support. And these happened to be single mothers. So as 
um, the Vice Chairman of CSR for Apollo. May I request Tejasvi, if this is okay, uh, can we go ahead and announce that we will have a free OPD for children over the weekends? Yes? Okay, great. Thank you, doctors. This will encourage more and more women to support single moms to support their young ones. And I'm here in this journey with you. It's been an emotional journey. I feel the same way that you feel. And let's get our children healthy and happy together. Dear media, I have two very big announcements today that I'm really very, very proud to announce. One is that we are launching uh, the Apollo children's mascot, the logo, and the swing. And number two is that you will have free OPDs for your children, the single moms can come and bring in their children over the weekends. So thank you so much. And I hope this really helps. I'm with you in this journey. Thank you so much, ma'am. Uh, that was a great announcement. I'm sure the children will love it. We want more children to come into it's our for hospital. the moms, because now I'm a mom and I know how the moms <laughs> feel. Yes, ma'am. But finally, the children are going to enjoy it too. Yes. So we want to make sure our hospitals are absolutely friendly to them. And uh, both of them have a great experience in our hospital. So what we want to do, ma'am, is that uh, uh, the, the backbone of any service we provide is our consultants. At Jubilee Hills, we have a fantastic set of consultants, all specialities under one roof. And a lot of people in Hyderabad as well as around did not know about it. So I would just like to invite all of them, ma'am, and you have, you know, just meet everyone and then we can just do an official launch of the logo also. I hope that's okay, ma'am. So I would like um, to invite all our consultants, introduce you to our fantastic group of pediatric consultants. Um, great now. So uh, uh, first of all, I would like to invite Dr. Koteshwar Rao. Uh, he's a senior pediatrician and neonatologist. He's been there, with the, has been with Apollo for a long time. She's a very senior pediatrician, and most probably most a lot of children will be seen by both of them. Next, I would like to invite uh, Dr. Sridhar. Dr. Sridhar is a critical care specialist. Madam, whenever we look at small children, one of the key areas is to make sure that our emergencies are very good in handling children. And that's where Dr. Sridhar comes in. And he is uh, core to managing the critical care cases that come to a hospital. Supporting him, obviously, is Dr. Venkatesh. He is Dr. Venkatesh. He is uh, uh, our intensive care specialist. And uh, critical care and intensive care are the pillars of uh, pediatric kids. Please, Dr. Venkatesh. I would like to invite uh, Dr. Yoga Nagender. Dr. Yoga Nagender is our pediatric surgeon. Uh, he is a stalwart in laparoscopic surgery. So thank you so much, sir. Uh, Dr. Mehul Shah, senior affable pediatric nephrologist. The whole Hyderabad knows him. It's, it's a pleasure to have him as a part of our team. I would like to um, invite Dr. Bhanudi. Uh, Madam, neurology has been increasing a lot. So small children come with neurological conditions. Dr. Bhanerji is a trained pediatric neurologist and he has already he's been an asset to our organization. Dr. Tarang Vora. Dr. Tarang Vora is the only pediatric trained qualified pediatric neurosurgeon in this region. So it's a, it's a pleasure to have him as a part of our team. Uh, Dr. Amol Gupta. Dr. Amol Gupta, you know, the way he smiles, he brings smiles to the faces of children who have Heart conditions. He's a pediatric cardiologist by training and a great asset to the team. Um, Dr. Ramesh Srinivasan. Dr. Ramesh Srinivasan is a pediatric gastroenterologist and a hepatic liver specialist, a liver transplant specialist. And uh, he, you know, there are a lot of children outside his room and they always come back with happy faces. Um, I would uh, like to invite Dr. Rahul Reddy. Dr. Rahul is here. Dr. Rahul is a pediatric endocrinologist. He couldn't, he couldn't join us. Uh, now, the one thing you mentioned, madam, is in our uh, Unfortunately, case. my own child faced problem in psychiatry, and we had no trained pediatric psychiatrist in, uh, in Hyderabad. So we have one in our team, which is a great asset. Uh, supporting all this, nowadays, Dr. Surya Balakrishnan and Dr. Airavati, both of them represent our genomics medicine team. They work with all the specialists. And we support children who have genetic problems to their underlying conditions. Um, there are some people who couldn't join us here. And uh, uh, you know, I would like to take their name. 
but one of the key things which is, which is there is the whole area of uh, hemato oncology which is blood condition dr chandana she embodies our mission all specialties under one roof so madam what i would request is if we can unveil the logo madam if This is our Apollo Children's logo. So all our hospital new image, Apollo Children's. And we thank uh, Ms. Upasana to be part of this whole event and start this whole journey that we will have all across the country. Thank you so much, ma'am. That you know, the first pediatric liver transplant in India happened in Apollo, right? And that child who underwent a pediatric liver transplant, madam, he's a doctor now, working within Apollo. So that's the kind of impact that we have been able to generate. We have done over 600 pediatric robotic surgeries, over 2,000 cardiac surgeries. Uh, our doctors are great academicians. We have about 49 DNB students being trained under all of them across the country. These doctors have more than 2,500 publications uh, to their, uh, uh, you know, credit, and uh, that's the power that we bring to the table. So our vision is to make sure that we consolidate comprehensive care for children across all Apollo hospitals, upper, under Apollo Children's, and make sure that we have all specialities under one roof in a child-friendly environment. That is Apollo Children's for you. That's all I can say. Um, I would like to invite uh, Dr. Ravindra Babu, uh, our Director of Medical Services, to deliver the word of thanks. Okay. Dr. Ravindra So, good afternoon, ma'am. Uh, journey start. Hello. Madam, Madarga, journey start in Trata, if you have a initiation and Single mothers, mothers be and a free consultation or a white chaser. And the mother got emotional journey start in Rata, mere initiation this put on Karana in the yes. So, uh, previously, uh, before I got pregnant, I witnessed motherhood, but now after I got pregnant, I actually know what is happening and what a mother goes through through my own personal journey. I completely know how stressed a mother is when the child is not feeling too good. And I think parenting is very important and I'm lucky to have a very, very nice spouse that can co-parent with me. But what about the single mothers out there who are parenting just by themselves without any help? That's where I feel the pain. And that's where I feel that, you know, I should be there and do my bit to make, to be a support to them. So I think that's uh, where it stemmed from. Thank you. 